Hey, Scruffy. How you doing? <clears throat> so I'm about five minutes early tonight. Oh, wow, you got a meow for me, huh? So, I have your hearty cuts with real chicken and beef. I think I put too much in tonight. I think I zoned out when I was uh, putting your food together, and maybe I put in a double dose. I don't know. I thought this was the last dose, but when I look in the bowl, it looks a lot fuller. So I guess you're going to eat well tonight. Okay, so I'm going to bring it out. Okay. I'm going to clean on the table. Get your water. Oops. Spilling the water. Okay. So I'm going to walk past you and change your water so your bowl is over half full. It did heat up a little bit today. But not nearly as bad as I was expecting. But the coming days are supposed to keep warming, so not out of the woods yet. Okay, so which way are you going? So you're blocking my chair. I'm gonna sit down. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so I got up at a semi reasonable time today, so I didn't get up extremely early for once. Didn't get up extremely late either. No, no, there's that cough again. Seems like he always starts coughing when I start petting him. Looks like he's about to groom himself again. Even though I got up at a semi-reasonable time, I was still kind of tired. So I'm kind of feeling sleepy all day. I've been trying to get a lot of work done, so... I guess that's a good thing, but... <clears throat> yeah, I got really busy this afternoon, and I was going to go for my uh, interval runs today and I didn't keep track of the time and kept knowing it, yeah, I kept you know, getting ready to go and then I kept getting distracted with uh, trying to finish with just one more thing. I kept saying that to myself, one more thing. And then I checked the clock and I'm already getting close to dinner time here. I'm like, oh, shoot, I gotta go now before I lose the sunlight and uh, miss uh, Scruffy's dinner here. <clears throat> and I actually wanted to water the garden after I got back from my run, but yeah, there was no time. So, I guess I'll have to do that. I don't know, maybe tomorrow? Oh, that was a violent grooming. Should I groom, groom that for him? Nah, I don't think he wants me to groom it. Or pet it. 
<clears throat> so the only good thing about my interval run today is that it was short, so leaving so late for my run wasn't uh, fatal since it's a shorter run, so I'd be done sooner. I was kind of tired in my run, and I just it was pretty winded. So I did get my breathing up, but uh, yeah, I felt like I was struggling. I'm not sure how well I did. I had to take a slightly alternate route to avoid some groups of people. <clears throat> and it actually, uh, yeah, it, the route I ended up taking, I ended up taking a shortcut through a field which actually shortens my route a little bit, so it looks like I was further ahead. <clears throat> but I'm not sh So I was further ahead, but I'm not sure if it's because I took a shorter route or if it's because I was actually running a little faster or a combination of both. And if I was running slower, I can't tell because if I was uh, faster because of the shortcut, yeah, I don't have a good measure. There's a solid uh, chin rub there. So, let's see, on my way to the park, I saw a new cat I hadn't seen before. This one looks like it has an owner because it had a collar with a bell on it. So when he was walking fast, I could hear the bell ring. So he was checking me out from a uh, front yard somewhere. And then uh, he came closer. And I said hello, and then yeah, he just, he didn't come right up next to me, but he was, yeah, seemed to be curious about me. And then I just kept going. And then suddenly, yeah, he runs around me and pulls ahead of me. And I didn't see that until I heard the bell. And so he was kind of walking with me for a while. And then I, uh, he started getting a little, or letting me get a little closer, and then I wasn't sure if he wanted me to pet him or something, and then he decided he'd run into the next yard and then watch me. So he's kind of stalking me. Get under the chin there, so that I liked it for a moment there. So I think I'm gonna get your food now. You're kind of calming down. One more pet? Okay. Let's get your food. So he has a little extra food tonight, so probably take him a little bit longer to eat. And then uh, I think I'm gonna go in, still running behind and everything. And I'd like to eat dinner. So I saw Scruffy today. Yeah, this morning when I woke up, yeah, he was sitting on the rocks and uh, 
Yeah, he's just, I guess, yeah, taking in the sun. And his tongue was sticking out, so he looked really funny. Decided to get my camera, but by the time I got the camera back, or I came back with the camera, he was already grooming himself, so his tongue wasn't sticking out anymore. So he pose. So I didn't get that on film. <clears throat> and then after he uh, groomed himself for a while, he stepped off the rocks and disappeared. And then I think I briefly caught him later in the day, drink, taking a drink of water. And then late this afternoon, I saw him jump onto the deck from the garden and then he disappeared. So I think he's been hanging around here all day. So I think yeah he's probably enjoying the hotter weather. It wasn't it wasn't terrible today. I'm worried it's gonna get worse in the next few days, but Today, today was manageable. <clears throat> so I've already lost count when the last time I watered uh, the entire garden was. So I know I watered uh, the dying tree a few days back. I was going to water the, the rest of the garden, but uh, I haven't gotten around to it. I can't remember when I last uh, did it, but I think I'm overdue now. And since it's going to warm up, I'm you know, probably going to take care of that soon. But yeah, I have a whole bunch of new things I uh, take care of. So I mentioned my cable, or my uh, internet service provider is disconnecting my service in a month. So i got to find a new provider. Uh, there's pretty much only one provider left. They have kind of a monopoly. I know they have, a, or they were, providing uh, promo coupons every now and then. And unfortunately, I don't think I have any coupons from that they've sent recently but I'm trying to look around to see if I can find a coupon <clears throat> I, had, I emailed a friend asked him about it he said yeah I can't even trust these guys he uh, said uh, <clears throat> when he signed up he requested a confirmation of the usage of the coupon in uh, like email, so he wanted a confirmation that he was getting the discount, and because uh, yeah, he didn't trust them, because yeah, the, the company has a really bad reputation. And uh, sure enough, yeah, he needed it. So I think fast forward a year or something, or I don't know how long it was, but um, <clears throat> maybe it was only a month, but. Uh, yeah, they charged him full price, and then he had to haggle with them again, saying, "Hey, look, you promised you were going to honor this coupon. I got it in writing." But, you know, so I think they honored it, but what a bunch of scumbags! So I'm not looking forward to any of this. <clears throat> yeah, the company I have right now, they're actually not bad. Um, I think they've treated me reasonably well. I, I wish I could continue with them, but yeah. As, as I understand it, they have no choice in the matter. Um, 
So basically they lease the lines from the telephone company and now the telephone company uh, is no longer obligated to lease the lines and so they're just cutting everything so you can't, nobody's allowed to use them anymore. <clears throat> and so people like me are screwed. So I'm trying to do uh, some back of the envelope calculations on how much data I use and if I'm going to exceed the, the monthly cap on the new service. So my initial back of the envelope calculations, I, I think I'm good. But yeah, there are, there are a few edge cases I'm worried about. So. Um, I forgot to take into account all the classes I'm taking right now, so that's actually increasing my uh, video bandwidth quite a lot. <clears throat> um, I usually try to use a lower resolution, but sometimes your software doesn't give me the option, and so I have to use <clears throat> you know, the, the highest bit rate that it will send. Though for my particular ca case, since I have really slow bandwidth right now, the auto, auto, it auto scales down pretty far, so I'm not using that much data. But the problem is with the faster connection I'm going to get, uh, these automated uh, players are probably going to try to use the highest quality um, video streams available, and so they're going to just completely sap up my uh, bandwidth and use up my data quota. So i got to do more back in the remote calculations on how much data my classes are costing me. So the other problem is, yeah, the classes tend to use third-party uh, video services. They're not using YouTube or you know some of the mainstream freebie ones. These are ones that they pay for themselves. And um, one thing I've noticed is they don't tend to compress their video is very aggressively. And I don't know if that's just because they don't feel compelled that they need to, or if that's the video service saying, yeah, whatever, we don't care. Um, or it's just um, they're not using very good video compression technology. Or, I don't know. Um, or not very aggressive video compression technology. They might be using very conservative settings. Because I, I feel like yeah, these uh, other services are using a lot more data than, say, an equivalent video I, I stream from YouTube. So it looks like Scruffy's almost done with this food. Let's see. There's some pieces stuck to the wall of the bowl. So it's trying to get those right now. Yeah, there's a little more under the ball, so it's not quite done yet. Let's see, oh, I saw the black cat that sits out in the middle of the field today. So he was sitting in yet a different part of the field today. There's a lot of fields at this park, so yeah, I think that cat's mission is to sit in every different location in that park. I see him almost in a different position like every time I see him. Oh, 
Oh, I saw that pretty calico cat. Once again, I was hanging out in somebody's uh, front yard. Sleeping. We were kind of resting, he was awake. On the trail, you know, there was a little, yeah, you know, somebody was walking their little dog and I had to pass them on the trail, and then that dog, you know, started yapping at me as I passed and was pulling the leash, trying to get away to chase me. The scrub is done. No, there's actually food left under the ball. I'm pulling out the ball. So I'm not going to let him waste that food. So I need to start thinking about a cheat meal for myself. I'm thinking it's time to use one of those uh, shirataki noodles. Probably do uh, spaghetti or something. I'm so busy, I haven't really had time to think about that or plan a complicated dinner, or cook a complicated dinner for that matter. Alright, we'll see how tomorrow goes. So I think I'm due for a recovery day soon, so... I might take it tomorrow, then I'm gonna check the weather. If it's true, so I'm gonna figure out which day is gonna be the hottest, and that will probably be my recovery day. So if tomorrow's not gonna be the hottest, and I don't think it is, I might go for a bike ride. Oh wow, he's taking off. Huh. Okay, well, I guess that's it for tonight, folks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.